I'm Emma. I'm currently in Wichita uh, at my parents' house. Hey guys, um, coming in from Denver, Colorado. My name is Jonah Pester. I'm a junior at the University of Kansas. This is what my life has been like after the outbreak of COVID-19. So the past couple weeks have been pretty crazy. I'm sure it's been for everyone. I don't know, my initial response, I guess, to this whole situation was that I thought it was kind of being blown out of proportion until I saw the statistics and I saw the numbers climbing and then people close to me started getting sick. Just left Target when we found out about school getting canceled. Like sitting there, we got the email like right as we were stepping out of the car. And like, I was like, ooh, this is like really serious. Yeah, and I looked like, at my roommate and we were like, we should call our moms. That's definitely what we should do. <laughs> Hearing all of this when I'm like in another country and I'm like, oh my God, we need to go back. I was really, really sad. It just made me more and more sad to realize like, oh, I won't be able to see some of the friends that I've made throughout the semester. I won't be able to go to classes again. I only had one class that was like in-person performance that was a musical theater dance class. Um, but my, um, my musical got canceled, but it's gonna happen next fall. Since classes are all online now for the rest of the semester, no longer get up and go to classes. Um, just do them from my computer but um, a lot of mixed emotions. I feel like I still haven't really processed it yet. Like almost everyone else's life, I don't really have a routine right now. I have only left my house three times this week. I have been getting up whenever I want to. This is where I've been doing all my like work, at this table, at this couch, and it's just too comfortable. I just am not getting very much done. Currently, I'm sitting where I have been spending almost all of my time during the quarantine. I'm using this time to, to write a little bit more, um, to watch a lot of movies, watch them, a lot of TV, catching up on everything on my watch list. Okay, here are the shows that I've been watching. RuPaul's Drag Race, Race. <laughs> New Girl, I love that show. Spider Squad, <laughs> Bring It, which is basically just like the black dance moms. I watched Love is Blind and I used Netflix Party to watch that, and it was super fun and exciting, and it like brought back memories of like middle school when you're like in chat rooms with your friends. Today was a gorgeous day, so I went for a run, socially distanced. Hey, good morning. Um, I decided I'm gonna make some healthier habits. I'll cook, I've tried baking. Just trying to give myself little tasks every day to do, so even if they're as small as wash your dishes or do your laundry, I made pasta, I made macarons, I made cookies. I've been reading a lot. These are my favorite books in the whole world. And we actually plan to shoot a short film in our house. Um, I just ordered this embroidery kit to do. I've been learning TikTok dances. Gaming all the time with my friends from middle school, high school, like kindergarten, we're all back. So I, I got a switch. Um, and I got Animal Crossing, so. Playing Mountain Blade, Banner Lord. It's coming out on the 30th. I've spent my time honestly just reading and doing word searches. Um, unfortunately, I got laid off. Everything's shutting down. We're not essential businesses shutting down. It's gonna kind of be a little scary financially, but I'm sure that's the same case with a lot of Americans. I was really unsure and really worried about all of this. Like, was I? Was I gonna get paid? Was I gonna be able to pay my rent? Both of my jobs have unfortunately closed due to COVID-19. I can't work at the gym anymore. Um, all of us are basically unemployed for an unforeseeable amount of time, which is super sad. So mental health has been a big thing that I've noticed deteriorating in a lot of my friends. And so I've noticed it's really important to be there for each other right now. Uh, I'm glad that people are taking the steps to try and contain this as best as they can. We should all just stay inside, play Animal Crossing, embroider, do some crafts. Figuring out this scary time is going to be a wild ride for a lot of us, especially those of us that were supposed to graduate in May. I think it's just kind of tough to sacrifice those like special occasions, especially like during a national quarantine. But I mean, rather save the world, right? So, 